Welcome to the oh, welcome to the Sand Creek Weekly video. Hi, Sand Creek stars! It's time for another weekly announcements video. How about we start this week with a joke? Okay. Why do we tell actors to break a leg? Because every play has a cast. <laughs> That's so good. Next, Karis has some, has a special report from um Karis. Where are you? Well, Karen and Avery, I'm at Sesame Street. Now that our classes can go on field trips again, our kindergarten stars will be arriving here very soon. Earlier this week, we asked a few of them what Sesame Street character they are most excited to see. Here's what they said. Emma. Big Bird. Emma. Cookie Monster. Cookie Monster. Um, oh, is in my heat up? Cookie Monster seems to be the favorite. I heard that the first graders were going on a different field trip. Jamel, where are you? I'm waiting outside of Sand Creek right now. The magic school bus just pulled up, and I think, I believe, that Miss Frizzle just will open the door to let the first grade stars in, in any moment now. Looks like she's ready. Hey, Arlene, are the second graders going on a field trip too? Sand Creek stars, I have been ready to go underwater to Bikini Bottom. As you can see here, I'm already at SpongeBob's house. His alarm should be going off soon, but I don't want to wake him up yet. You know how cranky he can be. While I wait for him to come out of his pineapple, let's check in on Lincoln about the third grade field trip. Well, Arlene, our third grade stars know how important it is to learn about the history of our great country, so they're going to Washington, D.C. to tour the National Archives. After that, our stars will also go here to the White House for a very unique opportunity. The president is going to personally give them a t the tour. What an um, exciting day this is going to be. Tate, what will the fourth grade stars be doing today? The fourth grade stars are going to the stars on an adventure of a lifetime. They're headed to the International Space Station and one lucky star will put on a spacesuit and go for a spacewalk. Let's head back down to Earth to find out from Antar where the fifth graders will be going today. Wow, that would be fun for the fourth graders. How about the fifth grade stars? Hey everyone, where are we going? To Disney World! World. Yeah. Yes, that would be fun too. Have a great day everyone. Earlier this week, we conducted a very scientific poll to find out what Sand Creek stars like the best about school. Here are a few of the responses. I like recess and lunch! I like recess and lunch! And for recess because outdoor recess is also fun too. Recess! Recess and friends. Lunch! 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 Lunch? Yeah. Alright. Will we the lunch time? Recess! Well, the results are in. We know that they are highly accurate and contain no margin for error. Sand Creek stars overwhelmingly said that recess and lunch were their favorite parts of the day. 61% responded recess and 38 with lunch. Just 1% picked something else as their favorite part of the school day. That's so interesting. Who would have thought that? I know, right? I wonder what the principals think of all this. Hey, Sand Creek stars. Um, I have to say, and Mr. Anderson, maybe you're shocked as well, but I'm shocked by the results that I just heard. So the only parts of the day that our stars like are recess and lunch. What does that mean for our school? Well, it means we we are way overstaffed. I mean, they just want recess and lunch. We just need, I would imagine, recess Paris and lunch Paris. So. I don't know about you, but you could save a lot of money by just firing everybody else, right? Do they, wait, do they even need an assistant principal anymore? I... Well, you know, we could talk about that. I think I still would like an assistant, but I think we could just fire the teachers and the rest of the staff, Mr. Moss, we could just fire everybody. If we're just going to be in the cafeteria and outside on the playground, maybe we do that. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Where are you right now? Well, you know, speaking of firing everybody, you know, that would, honestly, that would free up a lot of money. And so I uh, kind of like the grade levels and, and where they're heading on their field trips. I, I decided to take a little personal field trip, just myself, with some of that extra money that we're going to save from firing everybody. And I'm basking on a 
beautiful beach. No more Minnesota snow and sleet and rain and cold and wind. It is beautiful out here. Beautiful. Wow. Yeah. I'm jealous. I wonder if we have a a character strong character trait that would help me with that feeling right now. Oh, you well, know what? what it's is, April. It's, it's all, April. It's April today. Awesome. Yeah. It's April 1st. So that means that we do have another character trait to talk about, and that's honesty. And what honesty is, is living truthfully in your words and in your actions. So, Mr. A, are you living truthfully right now? I am living peacefully, uh, and I am living warmly. And it is beautiful here in the tropics. Um, what was your question again? Are you living honest? Honestly and truthfully right now. Uh, so honesty is, it's a good thing. It's a good thing. It's, we're going we're gonna to focus on that in April. And so, yep, as this warm ocean breeze uh, just hits my face, uh, honesty is a good thing. I like it. It's a good thing. We do expect our stars to always um, live truthfully and show honesty. Uh, you know, I have this chair over here, Mr. A. Yeah? Yeah, you want to come on over and... Oh, all right. You know, honesty is important, and I think as principal, I should probably model that for our Sand Creek stars, right? And so in the spirit of honesty, our character trait for the month of April. April Fools, everybody. I'm here in the assistant principal's office. And I'm sorry, but those wild field trips, we just do not have it in the budget, and your families would miss you way too much if you went that far away. No, we're not getting rid of anybody, because we need everybody that works at Sand Creek, because they do such a great job for our Sand Creek stars. And we know that while our stars enjoy recess and lunch, we do know that they enjoy the learning parts of the day, too. That's come up in our conversations with our student voices. It has, and we know that they enjoy it because kids are learning here. Mm -hmm. And they're making progress, and they're growing in what they know. And we're really proud of you. April